next to a play versus the Swiss Jakub Klassenem. Swedish masters in table tennis have proved once again that they're the strongest on the European continent. Today they beat the German team in the Superdivision League. The Swiss have once again proved that they are the top team winning the cup. The strongest CIS gymnasts, strongest in the world, will, com will compete in the traditional Moscow International Superstar competition this next week. Representatives of 20 countries held a press conference for journalists, revealing that the prize, prize fund has reached over two and a half million rubles. One achievement of the organizers was that students will compete for free. In the CIS Hoppy Cup Championships, Arhangels beat Krasnoyarsk in the finals with a score of 10 to 2. However, this is, while this is a disappointment to the Krasnoyarsk supporters, they have performed this year well with authority and class as well as winning the title. Maybe this is only a temporary retreat. The Russian financial industrial group. Well, that's all the news for today. It wasn't all optimistic, but that was the news for the day. We'll give you further news after the sports. Good night. And now the weather forecast. In the central Black Earth region, 0 to 5 degrees Celsius. In the central Russian region, 0 to 5 degrees. Azerbaijan, 12 to 17 degrees. In Belarusia, 3 to 8 degrees. Kazakhstan, negative 4 to 2. In the south, 0 to negative 2. 0 to 2. In Moldova, 2 to 7 with light precipitation. Turkmenistan, 14 to 19 degrees. In Uzbekistan, 13 to 18 degrees. Tajikistan in the valleys, 13 to 20 degrees. In St. Petersburg, 3 to 5 degrees. In Moscow, this evening, 5, negative 5 to negative 7. Tomorrow, also negative 5 to negative 7.